Niggas the fuck out. <laughs> nah, you know that's just I, I got that name back in the hood. I don't know. I used to write graffiti back in. The hood. I call him. I call him Yayo. They call me Yayo though. So, Danny, you could assign any artist to your record label, yeah. but you go with him. Is he the Danny Garcia of rappers? Definitely. Yeah, basically. Definitely. I've been through the struggle like Danny. Yeah. You know what I mean? We're from the same. We're from the same hood, man. He, he yeah. got a dream. I had a dream, and I'm. I'm just trying to support his dream. That's it. You know. Man, Looney gang. And I feel like we've been through the same. You know. A lot of people didn't believe in Dan and he proved them wrong, so I feel like I got I got the opportunity to do the same thing. Do you remember the days before you were famous, before you were Danny Garcia, where you were just up and coming and people kind of wrote you off? And yeah. What was that like before the fame? I mean, I, I, I kind of feel the same, to be honest with you. Like, I'm a humble person. Like, sometimes I wake up and I'm like, damn, I'm the champion of the world. Like, true. So to me, it's like the same thing. I, I'm, I'm still in my same neighborhood every day. I, I, drive, my, I drive a foreign car through my own neighborhood. Like, that's right. And nobody touched my car. Everybody loved me. That's how much. That's how much respect I get from where I'm from. So if I came to visit and you didn't tell people, my my backpack, my camera, my watch might not, might not last. This shit gone. I mean, it depends. What, it's it a nice little depends, camera right here. It depends what season it is. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right now. Right now, I'm gonna say it's Merkel season. Yeah. They, they hungry out there. They, they need some. They need some Christmas. This is a nice polo jacket. Right? Yeah. <laughs> no, Knox is, is up and coming. Yeah. He's not super famous yet. Yeah. He's on his way. What yeah. advice do you have him to deal with the money, the fame? Because you keeping it yeah. very level headed. You're not going. No, I mean, um, see, spend my shit moderately, you know. Man, you know what to do. You're a grown ass man. You know what I'm saying? You're a grown ass man. You know what to do. You know what I mean? Fly G5, not G6. Well, I'm not fucking with you. You know. Shane. Shane. Oh, yeah. How you feeling, Shane? All right, what's up, man? Come here, Chris. Tell us what you think. Tell us what do you think about this young champion right here? Oh man, he's great, great champion. I mean, showed me uh, a lot of skills in the last fight. Not not just uh, not just his uh, fighting ability, but his boxing ability was was uh, extraordinary. I mean, he's a great champion. And uh, I'm looking for some great things from in the future. I know that you know he's gonna be champion for a long time. A lot of people didn't believe in him, but that was making people into believers. You always believed in him. Why? <laughs> well, I believe you know that he has he has what it takes. He has a lot of heart. You know, he fights with a lot of ability. You know what I'm saying? It's not just he's not just a hard puncher. It's not just you know a guy that can knock you out. It's also he also can move around box up if he has to. He does what it takes to be the best. He does what it takes to, to win the make fight. Adjustments. Make adjustments. So there you have it. I said all these things about you. How does that feel? Oh uh, man, it's amazing because I, I grew up watching Shane like I was a little kid like you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you got green eyes like, like, <laughs> <laughs> like you know say Shane and Daddy got green. So, like, I, you know, I, I, like, it's, it's crazy, man. I remember back in the days before he was a world champion, before he was even a contender, yeah. talking to him. In the, I, I'm not sure who it was that, but I, I talked to him in the back. Philly. I think it was in Philly. He was in Philly. Yeah. We we'll talked to him in the back. He said, like, oh, man, what, what does it take to be a champion? I said, yeah. man, it's a hard determination, man. You just keep going, keep going. Yeah. Pretty soon, it's gonna, you're going to be a world champion. It's going to come like this. It's going to come fast yeah. before you know it. And here he is. He's a world champion.